you know everybody says how do I know what hole to go into when I'm out mud riding and that's just one of those things if you aren't with somebody that knows the area and knows the mud holes you really don't know how deep they are some people are like oh well I like to throw a stone in or you know I'll take a stick and I'll walk around and probe the outside of it and you know unless you you know got a pair of waders like yesterday you know Justin was with us from Gator Waders we actually physically walked into a couple holes just to see how deep they were and then there was one hole that we didn't walk into that didn't look bad at all that ended up biting us you know Tyler went into it and just nose planted ran out of ground clearance it was uh, one of those holes that's going to eat you up yeah I mean you have to have a serious machine to uh, get in some of these mud holes and you know there's some guys out here running around with 50 60 inch tires you know I think there was someone out here you know not long ago with 54 inch tires just out rolling around going through all these mud holes so when you got something that has that much ground clearance and that big of a tire they're going to make some big holes and when you try and go through that hole with a stock machine or fairly close to stock machine even if you're running 30s 32s 35s you know you're still going to run into some problems